Instagram now allows up to 90 seconds of content inside of Reels, which means any video longer than that is going to go into the normal video feed and work with that algorithm. Anything under 90 seconds is going to go into the Reels category and probably get seen a little bit more. So let me show you how to do this inside of your platform so you can add this into your repertoire of content on social. So once you are on your platform, you are then going to go into Reels. So up at the top right hand corner, you see that little plus sign. You're gonna tap on that and you're gonna tap on Reels. Now my phone is sitting on the desk so you have that nice black screen, but this will be you where you can swipe up and add your video or you can film it here directly. You're gonna see on the left-hand side, you've got that little music note and below it, you're gonna see 60 seconds. Now this might be on the opposite side of your phone because I have two different phones and they're on opposite sides. So just look for the little circle and it will have a time in it. When you tap on that, you know have 15, 30, 60 or 90 seconds. Now, if you don't have it yet, don't panic. They're still rolling things out. Sometimes it takes takes a hot minute. We know this, but this is how you access that 90 second reel. But let's talk about this for just a second, because this is really important. Should you be using 90 second reels? Yes, we do have a little bit longer that we can now create content, but most people stick around for videos. They get one to three, maybe three seconds to decide if they're going to watch that video. And then up to seven seconds of their attention once they decide to start the reel for them to decide to stay or to go. Anything beyond that tends to be swiped away. So the shorter you can make your videos, the better and the higher they're going to perform in the algorithm. So if you have longer videos, they do need to be packed with content. You need to be highly educational, highly entertaining, and have something that gets them some quick win or action inside of their life or their business. Do not just do it for the second or for the sake of doing it because those are not going to be pushed out in the algorithm system. Remember, your response to what you're posting in the algorithm system is based on watch time, watch retention, and the interactions that you get inside of the platform. So if you have a longer video and people only stay for seven seconds, that's a much shorter percentage than if you had a 10 second video and they stay for seven seconds of the 10 seconds. So the higher the percentage of them watching, the better you're going to do and the more that video will be shown out in the algorithm system to new people, which means you want to say what you need to say in the short amount of time as possible and get out of the way so that people watch more of the percentage wise of that video so it gets sent out to more people. Longer is not better in this case. We want to keep it as short and quick as possible so that they can move on and watch other content. Now, if you have something that is longer, that is okay. It's not totally detrimental to have a longer video. Just make sure it is packed with really good, strong content that keeps them hooked in. No pauses, no breaths, no weird uh, ways for them to like scroll away because you're not holding their attention. So you have to make sure that it is moving forward at a fast pace and giving really good content to keep them around for as long as possible. Hit that subscribe and notification as we are dropping even more breaking news from Instagram. This was not the only thing. We just dropped a video yesterday on a brand new feature and tomorrow we've got a new one as well. So stay tuned because we've got breaking news on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, live streaming, and more to help you take the time commitment out of your social media so you can make more profit in that business and actually run your business instead of being on social all the time. I'll see you in the next episode. And if you've got questions, drop them below.